Put on ESD finger cots and wrist strap before proceeding. Fasten the strap tightly around your wrist and connect it to the ESD monitor. Prepare the following tools. Phillips screwdriver, plastic tweezers, suction cup, fixture for attaching the adhesive film and press fitting platform. Guide the front camera BTB connector through the support hole. Align the front camera with the top edge of the shielding frame and press it into place. Do not touch the lens. Fasten the B2B connector. Apply thermal paste to the front cover assembly as shown. Insert the PCBA sideways in position below latch 1. Align it with positioning rod 1 and the screw hole on the right. Press down to align it with the screw hole on the left. Press latch 2. Arrange B2B connectors so as to avoid damage before installing the PCBA. Tilt the USB subboard as shown and align the USB port with the USB hole on the front cover. Align it with the positioning rod and press on the subboard. Press on the BTB connector of the USB subboard to adhere it. Ensure that the USB subboard is attached tightly to the front cover. Position the rear camera with its slot on the front cover. Align it with the top edge of the front cover and install it in place. Fasten the BTB connectors of the following components in sequence. Headset, rear camera, LCD, side button, battery. Main FPC on the PCBA and subsidiary board. Align the fingerprint sensor FPC with a fingerprint sensor BTB connector on the PCBA. Fasten the fingerprint sensor BTB connector vertically. Fasten the coaxial cable to the PCBA and subsidiary board. Line up the coaxial cable with a cable slot. Remove the release paper from the battery BTB connector. Insert the BTB connector steel piece into the left side latch. Rotate and insert it into the shielding cover. Align its screw hole with that of the PCBA and press it into place gently. Repeat this process for the right side. Remove the protective film from the pad and speaker holes. Insert the latch at the bottom of the speaker into its slot on the front cover assembly. Align the left, top and right speaker latches with the screw holes and press them into place in sequence. Remove the protective layers from the rear camera. Insert the three latches at the bottom of the rear cover assembly into the card slot on the shielding cover. Align the two latches on the top with the screw holes and press them into place. Use the Phillips screwdriver to tighten the seven white screws and two black screws on the PCBA in sequence. Tighten the seven black screws on the speaker. Ensure that the screws are tightened properly and without damage. Avoid touching FPCs when tightening screws. Attach a piece of copper foil to the shielding cover and rear cover assembly. Attach a warranty label to the screw on the rear cover. Remove the release paper from the adhesive film. Facing its sticky side up, align its positioning holes with the positioning rods on the top right of the fixture. Secure the film in position. Holding onto the battery cover with the suction cup, align it with the adhesive film and gently press on the edges. Peel off the outer protection from the adhesive film of the battery cover. Connect the edge connector of the fingerprint sensor FPC. Attach the mylar piece. Install the battery cover by aligning it with the front cover frame. 
Facing the phone screen down, put it inside the base mold. Place the base mold into the press fitting platform and rotate the handle to the limit. Insert the SIM card tray into its slot. Assembly is complete.